The 1st of July. The, is it the 1st of yeah. July? Yeah. Do you have 30 days only? Okay. Time flies. I know. It's Canada Day also. It's Canada Day also. That's well, right. Happy Canada Day. Please. <laughs> 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 Okay, so uh, shall we do for 8210, which was our fake law. In, in the feature, it was a card, a very nice card, uh, right here, feature 764, and it was in the kitchen, uh, partly in our bathtub, which is our feature 765, 775, what am I saying? Yeah. And partly on the kitchen floor that doesn't have a, a, any special number. And um, do we have anything interesting from mm -hmm. that? Need it one of um, the sample was too little, one liter. And then the uh, sample has a low density. Mm -hmm. um, there are very little plant remains. Uh, there's a little bit wood, some cereal wood? and chaff. Cereal amount is higher than chaff. One half lentil. Mm -hmm. And a few seeds. Uh, when when we compare the 8160, they are very similar. They are not, uh, the gold sample doesn't have uh, too much plant remains. And uh, 8164? 8160. Yeah. Do you remember what that was? Can you remind yeah. us? It was the same just place, yeah. Oh, it was above. It was the base yeah. floor. Above. No, no, it was the filling. It was the infill of the other. Uh -huh. so the infill and the stuff that was directly on the floor of the same feature mm -hmm. were very similar. Yeah, very similar. Okay. And so nothing special from your point no, of view, nothing, nothing more nothing. telling. Mm -hmm. is, it, is it also it's also typical for the hearts and ovens so Actually, <laughs> Low density. Lower than. Yeah. It could be because it was exposed for a while and we had a lot of, done a lot of cleaning in it. Yeah. But prior to taking the sample. But yeah. And also it could be because there were other floors uh, right above it of other fire installations that when they were building those, they were. Maybe cleaning a little bit before they would put a new one on the top. Mm -hmm. Because it was a very nice uh, part. It was uh, well preserved. And uh, you, you actually looked at only half of it because the other half was missing. It was truncated in prehistory. So we had only half of it. Maybe that makes it yeah. low density. And uh, what if, if you doubled everything that you have found in it? Would that be typical? Sorry. Let's use a standardized per liter, so. Aha. Yeah. Uh -huh. Okay. So, oh, well, I expected very much from that one. <laughs> <laughs> so interesting to me. So don't judge by appearance, then. Okay. The two of you, nothing. <laughs> nothing. <laughs> Boring. We should give you one of Jim's units. <laughs> yeah. Jim. Yeah. 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 like that. Yeah. <laughs> Those are those are very low priority. <laughs> they are very low priority, yeah. but they are high density. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even think about the ether. Okay. So the next one we should shall we do eighty one eighty eight, <coughs> which was the fill of this uh, <coughs> strange little cup right in the middle of uh, our big platform one sixty nine. And we uh, thought at first that it might be a burial, but it seems not to be. And the feel was not terribly exciting, except that it seemed to have some large uh, white speckles in it. <laughs> Did you find anything? Uh, again, low density. <laughs> <laughs> not, not much plant remains. Uh, Cereals and chalk uh, are in a very bad condition. <laughs> uh -huh. Um, series are burned. So burned so series. Yeah. And white seeds have a many variety, but they are in less amount. Mm -hmm. uh, there is uh, some white seeds, white plant seeds, mm -hmm. like mallow. What is that? Mallow. 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 Mallow.
confused by herbalists for um, <laughs> trying to remember you can get in rainbow. <laughs> no, no, it's a it's a powerful herbal thing. <laughs> so Nick, Katie, you must know or Elan. Really? And Malva is uh, a plant that uh, which is edible actually. Uh -huh. yeah. Mm -hmm. and the leaves are edible mm -hmm. and still today still uh, in Turkey we eat mm -hmm. ah, yeah. salad. Like salad. Like salad. Like salad. Like salad. <coughs> <coughs> it's like so we have yeah. to get that here in Yeah, sometimes we have. Well, for our barbecue. It has. Uh, yes. Is those, those that go like this round it? Arugula, we no, thought. No, 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 it's not arugula. No, no it's a, it's a, it has kind of a, a soft white part to it, which inspires marshmallow. Yeah. And it's used, and sour. It used it's to be sour. used. Ah, marshmallows. Anyway, it's used as also a powerful purple. <laughs> 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 we know. I think it's something to do with women or something or other, but I can't quite remember. It's rather goiter. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> <laughs> uh, and one piece of matcha probably pistachio. Uh, so this mallow thing, is that unusual or is it common for the Chattanooga in the past? It's common. Common? Yeah. So everything common. It, do you find, yeah, you do find charred seeds <coughs> in, in the packing of the platforms, do you? Because that, the, what we thought was the film could be just the packing of the platform that was a little disturbed and nothing special. Okay. Oh well. Anything else, Lisa? I think very little um, from <coughs> from the heavy residue. It's only twelve pieces. Um, it sounds like a lot. Twelve pieces of obsidian. No, no it's, it's not. not. It's um, it's from both one, two, and four millimeters. Mm. No, it's not very much. What would be very? What would be a lot? A lot would be a hundred pieces of all from the head fraction, uh, plus whatever comes out of the dry soap. <coughs> okay. Well, it is then very long. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sad to say. Uh -huh. And Lisa, did you have anything? No. All right. Then we come down to the packing, and we are talking about the packing in these two. <coughs> no, in this, this quadrant. And the packing. <coughs> And the packing that was on yeah. top of this floor and the, 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 floor, by the, the, the floor that was in front of it. So 8191, that? is that your packing or this packing? I can't remember. Is it? 8191, I think, is the platform packing. It sounds familiar. I can check very yeah, quickly. Yeah, you should check. Platform. Okay, it's on the platform. It's the platform yeah. Okay. Ooh, she's got a whole book here about herbal things. Yes. Very good. Okay, so the platform pack. What do we have in there? Yes, uh, we have little plant material. A little? Yes, not very much. Mm. And mm -hmm. uh, we have very fragmented chaff and very fragmented uh, cereal. And uh, there is a little amount, uh -huh. which shows me that uh, maybe after the process, uh -huh. they were just sweeping them off. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Secondary deposition. Secondary yeah. sweeping. And also I found rumex, which is fiddle duck. <laughs> ah, <laughs> oh. so this one that we can see all over the place. Right? Yes. <laughs> yeah. uh -huh. And which grows in wet areas, and the leaves are edible. I think uh, you should bring that with all the plants that you've <laughs> so That's lovely. It means so it's much more. It's an, is it marlow? No, it's an especially marlow. Especially marlow. Especially in this season, uh, the seeds are dry so that it's all over the place. Uh-huh. Uh -huh. So they're common in the ground, yes, basically. Yes. And, we don't, and you found the seeds in this yes. package. Because yeah. the, the leaves are... The leaves don't preserve. Don't preserve. Unless they are like the leaves. Right. That could mean that they're doing it all the time, messing around with the stuff. Well, yeah, the expectation it from is that the packing is the mix of the materials that come from the inside mm -hmm. the house and from the outside. Yeah. So it could be, yeah, could be that. 
if only we would only be able to say more about it if we had analyzed the entire um, sample, the entire, uh, not entire sample, but the entire packing. Mm -hmm. And if we yeah. found, uh, well, we would still not know about the distribution of these, whether they occur everywhere. Mm. So it's re really inconclusive if it comes from the outside soil that was just lying around on the ground that they took and put inside the packing, or it was part of their cuisine Mm -hmm. And then it got swept into the packing after cleaning the after cleaning the floor and all that. Were these remains charred? These seeds or charred? Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Would that indicate that they were burnt or as food, yeah. or that they were just uh, either they were accidentally burnt okay. or? They were just useless parts after cooking. Okay. But in any case, it was indicates that they were in the... to the one you're right. standing on. It's right. yeah. yeah. from one and two. Yeah. Okay, so the packing that I'm yeah. on the floor that I'm standing on at the moment is 8200. Yes. From 8200, um, it seems like there's a lot of activities because uh, there are different <coughs> kinds of plant remains like um, many parts of tuber, tubers mm -hmm. and again herbaceous matter from reeds and uh, wood is in mixed condition from uh, moderately burnt to very burnt uh -huh. and from very poor condition to good condition and since our again reed seeds Cyperaceae and mostly it's mostly chaff most of the material is chaff, but in good condition. Uh, and again, uh, more uh, less than half is cereal, uh, and it also shows that uh, it's a processing area. Mm -hmm. And uh, these are not the remains, but the processing part. Mm -hmm. <coughs> and uh, the cereals are in bad condition, but the chaff is in good, good condition, which is surprising. Do, do you find that combination anywhere else, in any other context within the houses? Yes, in middens. In middens? Yes. Ha. So they ha. use the midden, midden deposits for here, even though it didn't look like, as though it had midden. It wasn't, it was, it was sort of middeny packing. Well, it, it had a lot of burned, uh, crushed, medium-sized fragments of burned clay that came from a variety of fire uh, installation. And then it had a layer of clean bricky clay on top. Uh, but it didn't look as though it had much meaning, I must say. Now, uh, the question is where these large amounts of the fire uh, baked clay come from, because we have them all over the place in large quantities. It certainly is not one fire installation that they could use for all this packing in this huge house. So they must have been bringing these from either the, the fire installations on the roofs 
And then the assumption is if they were drying out the wheat on the roof and doing a lot of these processing activities on the roof, that this stuff could then get mixed up with those uh, hearts and hours that they had on the roof and got brought into the house and used as pattern. Or the same situation if you have it outside in the open spaces or on top of your middens, old middens. You have a little activities area with a fire installation, then you bring that stuff in and use it as packing. So that could make it. Sounds very possible because also there are uh, very few uh, micro remains. Because in middens we found many. Yeah. But in this case, there are few micro uh -huh. uh -huh, uh -huh. Okay. So, what do you see as the main difference between where she ate, eight, eight, what was that? Where you were standing, eight, 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 eight And 8199. Eight, uh, in 8191, uh, it looks like uh, it's, the, yeah. it's the remainings of uh, processing. Mm -hmm. But in this uh, one, it's the main processing area. Nice. Like, or uh, it was the dirt was taken from the main processing mm -hmm. area. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. I realized a lot of processing took place right here yes. in the central, on the central floor yes. and got mixed uh, as part of the packing. Now, um, mind you, we have not taken yet the very layer that's lying on the floor. We are not yet on right. the right plaster. So, so we're still keeping packing. those couple of millimeters thick layer of um, the packing. So when we scrape that off, then we'll give it to you as priority so you can then look at that and see whether this same kind of processing activity you can detect in that. If it is so, then it could be that the processing actually took place here and it wasn't brought from the outside. Okay, well, something to look forward to. Okay, the little, yeah, you said she uh, uh -huh. really small fragments, look at the identified species, and almost a little bit of being burnt in the temperatures. Burnt at low temperatures, okay, which again indicates cooking. But you did have more of that stuff in here, in the center floor, than in this pattern. You could see the difference between the two. Yeah, fair bit more. Or maybe just larger sample. Oh no, they're, they're the same size. And, and then the fifth. Six pieces. <coughs> Six pieces. Yeah. Six pieces of obsidian from the four mil um, plates. So mostly food remains and very little actually any other activity. <coughs> but is that is that situation typical for the house floors, say, comparing with the other house floors, or is it? We know that generally it was where the floors it's were very packing. clean it's and very packing, simple. Yeah. It's found and the and the pack. Yeah, um, for the moment I can't really see any difference between. Dirty and clean areas, <coughs> but I'll have to look into that a bit more. Mm -hmm. Sonia, did you have anything from the packing? From any of any of these, I had nothing. No, not even one of them. How sad. Well, it's interesting that the obsidian was was actual flakes rather than there's no debitage or anything. I mean, no little well, teeny, well, not weeny weeny ones. Mm -hmm. No. Yeah, there's mini ones. Yeah. I mean, it's it's not Four big millimeters. pieces that came up in the fall mill. Mm. Mm. Shall we go to the next one? 81, uh, 83, which is sample two and sample four, which is the unit that comes uh, from, so it comes right around the skeleton that we had in our burial seven by seven. Uh, yeah, no, no, one, eight, four, but uh, each is seven, five, seven. Yeah. Right, and it comes right around. And we know that here we had a basket and we had a, a baby buried in the basket and we had some other great goods next to it. And so all the soil that was around it, we gave to you. What did you find with it? <laughs> um, 
There wasn't any major differences between the two samples. They're pretty much the same. Uh -huh. They both had uh, high densities with wood remains. And without wood, they had a moderate density, so they still had a lot of other types of material. Um, let's see, they both had um, a diversity of materials. There was quite a bit of uh, cereal in um, pretty, pretty good conditions, a lot of whole cereals. Mm -hmm. And the chaff was also, there was uh, um, not very, there was very little chaff, but they were in good condition. Mm -hmm. And um, see, there was also some uh, tuber pieces mm -hmm. and um, uh, quite a few hackberries, which um, mm -hmm. is more unusual, and herbaceous material and dung. There's a little bit of dung. Mm -hmm. Charred dung. Oh. And and then um, there weren't very many seeds, but the ones that <coughs> were there, there's a mix of um, different kind of wild uh, seeds, like there was Rumex, this, this one here, the dock, mm -hmm. um, Scurpus, Carex, um, Pabesi, mm -hmm. and, and just in general everything seemed to be in um, pretty good condition. There was a lot of um, larger wood pieces. So they hadn't been moved <coughs> around too much and broken up. Okay. And just how it basically looked mid me. mid me. Yeah. Even the chart down is mid yeah. me. The yeah. positive. Yeah, well, definitely. I mean, it was mid me because mm -hmm. the burial was cut in, in the middle, not the foot, sure. yeah. yeah. But the, those large pieces of wood, they could be part of the Wooden sense of the charm. Yeah, they're oh, they large, I mean, like that big. Um, so, which looks very different than that. It's kind of right. like that. Yeah, we, we had uncharred wood. It sounds, it sounds very much like, I mean, it's coming from that black midney stuff yeah. down yes. there. Uh, it's sort of like the black midney stuff. Like that, one, yeah. yeah, which is the same midney, mm. basically. Yeah. Yeah. And that's where the stuff is. So you didn't have any beads in it or any no, pieces of copper? Hmm? Pieces of copper <laughs> or, yeah, or little bones, paper. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. Because you have a complete skeleton? <laughs> yeah, complete skeleton? Yeah, complete skeleton. Well, yeah, complete yeah, but I would think so. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> because if you don't, we need to do more uh, well, formation need, from the area. We need to do that anyway. Mm -hmm. Well, Okay, well that's it. Then the most interesting seems to me this whole, this packing that has all this uh, high activity. Well, especially when stuff. we come down on the the immediately above the floor stuff. Mm. Okay, so let, let's talk about the, the next week. Uh, priorities and then... Oh, we forgot to give you. Did you say to us what you have found in the... <laughs> you didn't have anything. <laughs> you couldn't raise your hand. Fragment of clay ball and one whole mini ball mm -hmm. that was in there. There are two um, bigger ones still in there at the very bottom. Mm -hmm. the okay. Probably should be as close as you know. Okay. Were they are they fragments or whole ones? Or? Uh, I think they're both fragments. Okay. Yeah, it seems so. <coughs> the mini ball is um, it's weird because it's like the one we had the other week from or last time that was partially fired so and partially fired. oxidized, so it was probably just. To me, it looks like it just been mixed up. These two pieces came from different areas, it seems, because the, the clay ball fragment had a lot of wear on it. It had been out and kind of trampled on. And the little mini ball, there's no way it would have survived that. So it was mm -hmm. probably, it looks like it's in pretty good condition. Mm -hmm. Maybe it fell in really work for the thing. No. <laughs> no, they probably were part of, you, you, you do get uh, 
clay balls from mm-hmm. Venus, right? Yeah, yeah. So, the same situation. Okay. So, um, so we have something coming up here, very interesting for you, bot people especially, is that storage bin. You see that thing that down there with, with a black, full of black deposits. But we cannot sample that yet because we're not completely, we haven't excavated it completely. But what we have, there's a sample out there of that now. They still have some. They have sample. a sample of that. Okay, all well, we can give it that. So yeah, that's right. We had uh, bits of this black deposit right around here that came outside, and so we collected that in a separate sample. And so we can give you that. What is the? Um, it's 8218 sample three. 8218 sample three. And um, that can be our priority. And another one could be uh, the scrape from uh, right on top of the floor, around it. We had uh, separated that in a separate sample. <coughs> the scrapings, which were uh, seem to be full of organic material and very sticky and stuck to the floor. And uh, possibly occupation deposits really in good condition. Uh, because on top of right on top of that we have this massive packing that you can still see here. But uh, this the this sample that I'm talking about was uh, different and it was sticking onto the floor very well. And this is uh, same unit. Same unit. Sample four. Sample <coughs> four. You got the similar kind of stuff sticking over yeah. there on that platform, on and that these level. These small samples you should yeah. have a much trouble. In this area, right where Peja is sitting, on top of this floor, on the, of this platform floor, um, we had in the we were removing the floor that was uh, right on top here, and in the packing of the floor, we had a number of four or five fragments relatively large fragments of pottery that were stuck onto the uh, this floor and uh, face down, so in, in, inside, inside of the pot, side was down. And we could see uh, very nice black organic deposits on it. So and the whole layer was, the whole there was a clear occupation, little thin occupation layer. Which is separated in a in Which is, um, that was put in actually, in, I think it's in the general unit. It's in the, the general packing unit, unit, and we'll give you that unit. It's a small unit. It's a thin it's packing unit. square up here. And, and the next door unit, I think, where John is right now, had it too. Okay. All right. And John, do you remember those units? That was 8117. 81? I think it's... I've got them here. 8217. 80 and 8225. 8220. 8225 is the northern one, and 8217 is the southern one where the pottery was found. Yeah, but you want this unit, that unit, and this unit, or you want no, those no, two? no, no, that that one where he is. That so the those two eastern, two the two eastern okay. units had so that. So that's 8217 and 8225. And. Uh, of being interesting, we should probably give you this one and that should be What about this, the oven that was taken away, stuff from that? The oven floor. That's true. That could be one. Except what they never find the anything on the oven. Tish. Can you wake up, Tish? Yes. What was the unit number of the oven floor? Um. 8231, was it? Yeah, I think so. Yes. 8231. That's the big floor of the big oven that we have, remember. So how many units is that? That's one, five, five, five two, three, four. They're <coughs> all very little. Is, does this seem like a lot or just fine? Or can I give you one small, yet another small unit? How about that? If you manage to do it, if you don't. It's this floor here, and this is an unusual feature that we didn't have before. And it probably will be, uh, our ex- expectation is that it will be something <coughs> similar to this uh, fire installation that you had up here, I mean the remains around it, but maybe not. So, um, where's Dragana? Dragana is not here, so Peggy, do 
14 and 8213 is the dirty floor. Uh, no, but is it, that's the, that's the upper the one. They're talking now about the lower uh, one, no, which is below. Yeah. Oh, look how many glasses I have. Okay, well, thank you very much. Thank you. Yeah. If you have any questions, it's time to ask now. <laughs> that was easy enough. <laughs> Go with the flow. So why would they put them in the packing? They bought it from Asia. I don't know. I think they're just getting it. And the mini balls are just in there. That's kind of what I had thought. What an asshole. <laughs>
Ali mislim da je Toma, tako i ne ono, znaš da je gledao sam neki njegov kon. Ovo je to osjeć. To je ono osjeć. Ovo je to osjeć. Osjećuje vzdušu iz telo. I don't know, but you took it was you, you, there was a unit. What are you doing? I don't know. I what are you up. doing? I just backed up. I didn't know she was. Why there. don't you guys look around you when you're doing something? I apologize. I'll look around next time. Come. I'll do it. I mean, you should just get too excited about whatever you're doing. I'll look. Oh. Um, it was. What was I can give you some. I can give you some. Uh, some possible unit numbers. Okay. But 